Hi everyone. Recently I had a question. Does using a case make your phone hotter while it's being charged? Now at first I thought, well of course it's going to make it hotter because the heat can't escape. The case is keeping the heat in. But then I googled it and there is a lot of different opinions on this. Many people say that the case actually helps because one, it keeps your hand off the phone so you're not transferring heat. And two, this actually acts as a kind of heat sink and it draws the heat away. Now, I can't imagine that's accurate because this is rubber or silicone depending on what case you have. And this one here, for example, is rubber on the inside and then polycarbonate on the outside. So in my mind, it seems like a Corsha phone is gonna get hotter with a case. But there's so much argument on this, I figured let's do our own test. So right now, the battery is at 33.9 degrees Celsius. And I'm gonna use my dash charger here, and we're gonna start the timer once I plug it in. There we go. And we'll leave this going for, I don't know, say three minutes, and then we'll check what the temperature is. And the battery right now is 32%. Okay, so I decided to let it run for five minutes instead. Our battery temperature is now 38.2 degrees Celsius and our battery percentage charge is 40%. So what I'm gonna do is wait for the phone to cool down and drain it back to 32% and then we'll do the same test again but with one of the cases attached. So now we're gonna try the same test again. We're at 32% battery, 32.8 degrees Celsius but this time it's inside a rubber protective case. So let's connect the charger, start the timer, and come back in five minutes. So it's been five minutes, let's disconnect the power. We're up to 37.4 degrees, and our battery is at 41%, or 37.5 degrees Celsius. So let me run the battery down again, and then we'll do the test all over again, but with the Otterbox case, so the battery temperature is at 32.7 degrees Celsius and the battery percentage is 32%. So we'll put it inside the rubber case and then put the polycarbonate casing on the outside. And that makes up the Otterbox case. So let's plug it in and start our timer. We'll come back in five minutes and see how it compares. So it's been five minutes, let's unplug it and let's see. The battery went up to 41% and the temperature went to 37.4 degrees Celsius. And now we're going to try one more test. The battery is at 32% and 32.7 degrees Celsius and we're going to run it on a fan. So no case and it's going to be sitting on top of this CPU cooler. So let's plug in the charger, start our timer and we'll come back in 5 minutes. So the five minutes is up, let's stop the timer. It reached 35.9 degrees Celsius and 41%. So let me just review my footage and work out what the difference was between all of those different tests. So I just finished looking at the results and I'm really surprised. Now I understand why there's so much argument online about whether putting your phone in a case will make it hotter during charging because apparently it doesn't. If anything, it actually performed a little bit better when it was put inside this case. So maybe there is some truth to this rubber material acting as a heat sink. I still find it so hard to believe, but I've just tested it myself. Now I know some of you might be thinking to yourself, well, maybe your ambient temperature's changed, or the phone was running something different in the background, or you know, some other variable. You should really run the test many times to get accurate results. And I agree with you, if you want proper scientific results, you have to do this test many times. But what I was expecting was to see a huge difference going from a bare phone to a cased phone. I was expecting to see a huge instant increase in temperature, and that was not the case. So for me, I'm very, very surprised by these results. Um, of course, the best thing to do is no case and sit it on top of a fan. If you want to keep your phone as cool as possible, that's the way to do it. You saw that that really did perform the best. 
Um, it does waste a little bit of power running this fan, but not a huge amount, and it will make your battery last longer in your phone. So yes, this really took a lot of time because I had to keep running down the battery, cooling it down, doing the test, really took a long time. So if you did enjoy this video or found it interesting, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.